position of gynesium on the thalamus. Based on the position gynesium on the thalamus in relation to other floral parts, flowers are divided into three types as follows. 1. Hypogenous flowers. 2. Perigenous flowers. And 3. Epigenous flowers. 1. Hypogenous flowers. Thalamus is convex or conical. The gynosium is present at the tip of the thalamus. The remaining floral parts, like calyx, corolla, and rhesium, are arranged at the base of the gynosium. In this flower, ovary is completely present outside the thalamus. So, it is called superior ovary. Examples, hibiscus datura. Periginous flowers. Thalamus is concave or saucer-shaped. The gynesium is located centrally in the thalamus. The remaining floral parts like calyx, corolla, and rhesium are arranged along the margins. In this flower, ovary wall is adnated to thalamus only at the base. In this flower, ovary is present partly inside and partly outside the thalamus. So, the ovary is called half inferior or half superior ovary. Example, Tephrosia. Epigenous flowers. The thalamus is deep cup-like in appearance. The ovary of the gynesium is completely embedded in the thalamus. The wall of the ovary is completely fused with thalamus. The remaining floral parts like calyx, corolla, and andrisium are arranged along the margins of the thalamus. The ovary is completely inside the thalamus. So, the ovary is called inferior ovary. Example, tridax. Thank you.